We are going through unprecedented times of challenges and trials. It's such a unique time that we often hear people saying, This is historic. Never has mankind experienced anything like this. Life will never be the same. The reality is that mankind has always been tested in different ways by the Almighty. The Quran tells Nabi Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and his companions that previous prophets and messengers were tested. أَمْ حَسِبْتُمْ أَن تَدْخُلُوا الْجَنَّةَ وَلَمَّا يَأْتِكُمْ مَثَلُ الَّذِينَ خَلَوْ مِنْ قَبْلِكُمْ Do you think you will enter paradise without experiencing trials similar to what the people who passed away before you experienced? مَسَّتْهُمُ الْبَأْسَاءُ وَالذَّرَّاءُ وَزُلْزِلُوا حَتَّى يَقُولَ الرَّسُولُ وَالَّذِينَ آمَنُوا مَعَهُ They experienced suffering and adversity and were so shaken in spirit that even the Nabi and the believers called out, مَتَى نَصْرُ اللَّهِ when will Allah's help come? Ala inna nasr Allahi qareeb. Verily, the help of Allah is near. We should keep in mind that this verse was revealed to Nabi Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam when the Muslims were going through difficult times. And it is meant to remind us that difficulty is part of life and that Allah's victory and help is always near. And this verse is a means of granting hope to Muslims. What hope? The hope of ease after difficulty and entering paradise in the year after. By reminding us that even the prophets from the past had to go through trials, it gives us hope that with patience, there's a good outcome for us all. Almighty Allah will make things work out when and where we never expected. وَمَنْ يَتَّقِ اللَّهَ يَجْعَلْ لَهُ مَخْرَجًا وَيَرْزُقُ مِنْ حَيْثُ لَا يَحْتَسِبْ وَمَنْ يَتَوَكَّلْ عَلَى اللَّهِ فَهُوَ حَسْبُهُ And whoever fears Allah, he will make a way out for him from every difficulty and he will provide for him from sources he does not expect. This verse is found in the chapter of divorce, talaq in the Quran. Divorce is an experience where one feels their life is falling apart. It is in the context of this tremendous difficulty that Allah reminds us that if we remain conscious of Him, do not transgress on the rights of others, that Allah will make a way out for us and provide us from where we did not expect. Ultimately, the Quran shifts the psychology of the person that they see the greater picture of what they are going through. One must trust that Allah ultimately knows best and has the best plan for each person, be it in this life or the year after. Likewise, during the times of COVID-19, we should keep our trust in Allah and have hope that He will make it easy for us.